Uh, today we are going to um, go through a PLSQL lesson. Uh, we are going to today learn how to use row number analytical function to find out nth position uh, nth position uh, in a row. Uh, uh, row number is, a, an, is an analytical function by which you can uh, use a partition by you can what I Uh, by which you can not only uh, find find any position of a certain uh, number of rows or uh, certain from a certain table, but you can also uh, find any position of of certain groups. Suppose uh, you uh, there are uh, uh, different classes in a school and a table contains all the records of that uh, of all the students in an in one table now we want to find suppose the the, the child the student who got uh, who is the 10th from each class from class 1 to class 10 everybody has in every class the student who ranked 10th so I don't have now in that kind of example I cannot give you. So I'm trying to so, sort out this uh, SQL query to make you understand by the, all the resources I have. I have the resource uh, like some, uh, I have the um, HR database in which I have two tables. One is employee master and another is employee salary. Now what I am going to do, I am going to find out uh, all the employees in each month, in each month which employee has, uh, on based on gross pay, has ranked a certain position. Suppose I want to find uh, who has got the second highest salary in a certain month and I, I will find out in a single query I will find out all the employees who have got the second highest salary every month so it will show you the employee name employee code employee name the month and uh, the month and he will be the person and, and it's cross pay and he, this is the person who got the second highest salary we can also I can also show you by details uh, I'll just show you some samples by which we will find out that whether the query is giving the correct result or not so uh, I'll first write the query here this is my PLSQL developer it is connected to my Oracle database which is in my CentOS 6.5 Oracle 11G and it is connected uh, through uh, Putty the SSH uh, client so in pure SQL developer I will just open an SQL window and first of all I will write the analytical function and then I will put feed it into a sub query so this is my query select uh, employee master dot encode in name Achha, first let us see uh, this is the two table employee master and employee salary employee master contains employee code employee name and employee salary contains in payment here and gross pay so employee, uh, employee code employee name uh, then pay month year and gross pay then the analytical function row number over now I will put the I will partition it by partition by I will show by month year for every month year the second highest gross salary the partition by two month year and order by gross pay in descending order 
see when I will put in descending order uh, row what row number will call uh, first, first let us uh, complete the query uh, so this is the analytical function part row number over partition by Piermontier order by gross pay DSC I will give it an LS name say RN so this is my query now I will put this in a sub query and just uh, give it an alias name say X ok so select x dot end quote x dot end name x dot payment year and x dot gross pay from and from this is the table x and order by x dot payment year So this is the query and uh, now see, now what happened, here it is partitioned by payment here, so the data is partitioned before ordering the data is partitioned by payment here, ok, it is grouped by payment here, all the records are partitioned, so each payment here contains a certain number of records, now that each certain number of records is ordered by cross pay every every payment year every partition record uh, of a certain payment year they are ordered by their cross pay in a descending order and after that what i am doing just a moment i just put the order by in the wrong position so this is done now see x where x dot rm equal to now when it is ordered, what I am doing, I am taking, the, it is written in the row number, all the row numbers, okay, and the, these row numbers are in an, uh, in, uh, in an ascending order, because first it, it is uh, ordered in a descending order of gross pay, now the row number is created, 1, 2, 3, 4, so it is getting a second row, so obviously this row number 2 will contain the second highest gross pay for a certain payment year. Okay, so this is the query. Mm, I hope there is no syntax error into this. Yeah, of course, there is. So let us see where is the problem. Row number over. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, where is the table? Where is the table from? Extremely sorry, imply master. Master inner child employee salary on on. master dot imp id equal to employee salary dot imp id and I just make it filter out with one particular imp I am not interested on in others so and So let's see, okay, there's a little bit of spelling mistake, uh, payment here, payment here, I hope, yes, see, so this is uh, given a case, this is the second highest salary, so we will just select this one. Zero one two zero zero nine, and check out. Select cross pay. Mm, okay, sorry. Select 
end code uh, end name employee master that end code end name cross pay from employee master in a join employee salary on okay let's copy it from here employee salary on Increase equal to S order by Ross Pay DSC and we will just add another one and pay month year equal to zero one two zero zero nine. Okay, see, is the second highest, and let's check another one. This is the third highest. It is in E for zero one two zero one zero. This is the right one. You can check it out. See, seven eight four zero zero seven eight four zero zero. So how see how we have just faced out. Uh, Month wise, all the employees who got second um, second highest salary in that particular month. So this is an analytical function known as row number, which uh, gives you uh, this uh, how well a type of rank, or a type of highest salary, or highest marks, or whatever you need. So. You can just go through this uh, SQL statement and I can it's okay let's uh, uh, beautify this one and put it here just pause your video and check check the query so this is all about a row number analytical function and uh, I hope uh, you understand this. If you have any query regarding this uh, analytical function, you can just uh, comment. Uh, uh, comment. Me, just send me message, and I am ready to help you. I uh, hope you like this video. If you like it, do subscribe to my channel and share this video as much as possible if you can. Thank you very much.